In Davidson County, we now know the name of the company that up until this morning was codenamed Project Puma. It's Dynapon Printing, also known as DNP. It's a Japanese company that makes, among other things, lithium ion battery pouches. And Fox 8 Celeste Smith joins us now live in Davidson County with more. Celeste, what will this latest economic announcement bring the area? The company plans to create more than 350 new jobs with an average salary of more than $50,000. I spoke with local leaders who are excited about the company coming to the county, and they said that they are looking forward to the much anticipated growth they are seeing here in the county with businesses like DMP coming and looking for sites here. Davidson County is growing and it's going to continue to grow. It's a good place to be. Dynapon Printing, also known as DNP, will build its advanced manufacturing facility on 49 acres at the I-85 Corporate Center in Linwood. The company manufactures lithium-ion battery pouches for electric vehicles. It's a great opportunity for our young folks getting out of school and getting out of college. Uh, be a great opportunity for them. We've got a good workforce development uh, here in Davidson County, so we're working with the young folks in high school, and uh, hopefully it'll be a gateway to them to move right on into uh, a good paying job. He is just the latest economic development to come to Davidson County. Construction is ongoing for the Siemens Mobility Building, a $220 million train manufacturing facility in Lexington that will create more than 500 jobs. Lexington Mayor Jason Hayes said having two large economic developments in the area will be a great asset in drawing more people to live in the city and nearby surrounding area. They're able to uh, buy homes and live here. Uh, they're able to participate in the retail sector uh, as well and have growing opportunities. So, um, and they also uh, may locate here and send their children to school here locally. County officials say these new job developments create more opportunities. They're hearing from other major companies expressing interest in potential facility sites in Davidson County. There's going to be several, uh, you know, fingers to these businesses uh, that they will need suppliers, and they've already been looking. They've already been talking to us uh, about some other sites. Uh, so, you know, they got to have a uh, network of, of suppliers. The Northern Davidson Chamber of Commerce believes it also has the opportunity to draw more small businesses to the county. While we don't necessarily have any influence or say so on these larger corporations coming in, what happens is when the families of those employees come to our area, then we create newer small businesses. The state also approved DMP for a 12-year job development investment grant. The company is expected to grow the state economy by $691 million. Live in Davidson County, Celeste Smith, Fox 8 News. Celeste, thank you.